All right. Eric Mark, standing in place, dun dun dun, in the year 2000. 21, 21, 21, 21. 2021, we're still standing in place. Episode 48. I do have a goal to get to 52. I don't know what happens after that. Oh, look what I did. Crazy screaming cursing lunatic. Four miles every four hours for 48 hours. It seemed ridiculous. And then I kept thinking about it. Walking four miles an hour is odd and you are definitely one of those speed walking style things. I got cactuses stuck in my leg because I was dumb. I did it and I took minimal damage and I'm freaking stoked and I'm excited to share that with you. So I'm going to make an actual video for that. Uh, so stay tuned, because very exciting. Eric Mark, the mental treadmill, is going to release David Goggins, 4x4x48, four by four by <laughs> aspiring comic video sketch improv sometimes guy. Tries to do athletic stuff, really loves riding bikes. Attempts the 4x4x48. Four by four by uh, <laughs> so I listened to a raving lunatic. Uh, with 20,000 of my best friends, because, you know, 1 o'clock in the morning, I have to get up, go do 4 miles. 5 o'clock in the morning, go do 4 miles. 9 o'clock, 4 miles. 1 o'clock, 4 miles. Just do it, do it, do it. I didn't get more than 2 hours of sleep in a stretch. I put up a clip of, uh, of an ice bath that I drew. I drew an ice bath. I drew an ice bath in order to cool my muscles, all of my muscles. <laughs> I was asked... Ms. Burris, this, this answer is for you, uh, if, if it was effective. And uh, yeah, I, I don't really know. I will tell you that the ice bath is uncomfortable as hell. I did not, I know I've done it before, and I don't know what the difference was. This was horrible, and I don't know if it's because I had almost 50 miles on my legs at this point. Um, but it, it did two 20 pound bags of ice, the coldest water that would come out of the spigot, filled up the tub, got undressed, started the timer, because I'm like, oh, I'll do it for a minute, climbed in the tub, and my fucking ankles and my feet and my personal bits hurt so bad. It was ridiculous. I, I would have rather gone out and done another four miles, another four miles barefoot with a cactus in my leg. I would have rather done most anything than stayed in that freaking tub. I was doing Le Mans breathing. Le Mans? Le Mans? Le Mans. Race car breathing, you know. I was doing Le Mans breathing. Like I was giving birth, but I wasn't because nothing was coming out of me. Only parts of me were going in. Nothing's coming out. I was breathing audibly. My wife's going, what the hell's going on in there? Are you okay? Because I, it was so hard to stay in that freaking tub because of the bits that hurt, hurt so bad. Now I will say the legs, if I could have isolated it to like my legs and knees, I think I would have been good. And I think, I think, so I can't answer the question, I think it did help. Antillary circular system. I don't know if that's the right way to say that. You know what? The four by four. 48 has prepared me for what's coming. What's coming? Are you aware of what's coming? I saw it on the news. I saw it on Instagram news. The snow is coming. The snow. Hey everybody in Colorado. It's gonna snow. I was calling it six feet of snow, but that's not really true because that's not how math works. 60 inches is not six times one foot because one foot is not 10 inches and 6 divided by 6 is 10, so that's not right. 6 feet would be 72 inches. Is that right? <laughs> I did it right. I don't know why you question. I don't know why you question. So smart. So smart. <laughs> so where the hell did all the propane go? Unless everybody's grilling in their backyards in a snowstorm. Which I'm actually supposed to do. And they're ready for the snowmageddon, the unexpected weather occurrence in a state that is known for its snow. All right, have a good night, y'all.